Florida State used four runs in the bottom of the fifth and another strong outing by Brandon Liebrandt to win this one 6-1 to one over UCF and claim the season series. It was a good win. There's no two ways about it. It was a good win. Obviously, the conditions were tough for both clubs. Lee Brett did a very good job. Uh, Gage did an outstanding job, and let's face it, that's what it's about. Able to make some pitches here and there. Uh, great defense behind me. Um, some of the best catches I've ever seen. Uh, but no doubt, it was a great team win. That's what we work every day to do. I mean, uh, we're a defensive team. I mean, we make uh, some errors here and there, but I mean, that's just the game of baseball. And that's what uh, Meat tells us. I mean, he said we want to make the pitcher feel like, I mean, he's nothing. So we just want to battle him, uh, go into deep counts, make a bunt here and there, just uh, play the game of baseball. Guys kept their poise. Things didn't go exactly right a couple of times. We left runners on. I bet you I didn't look. We left double figures. And uh, guys just kept on battling and scrapping and clawing. And I'm just very, very proud of them. It's huge for momentum. Uh, anytime a guy makes a play like that, it takes away a base hit and that just kills the rally. And, uh, you know, he's trying to go back out there, <laughs> throw uh, next strike one, and uh, get the guys in the dugout. The Seminoles will look to sweep UCF on Sunday afternoon at 1 p.m. Scott Seitz on the mound again for the Florida State Seminoles. So here inside Hauser Stadium on Saturday evening, I'm Scott Kodak reporting for Seminoles.com.